A star-packed, powerful actress category with a first-time nominee. History is made with two nominated couples, and Will Smith's name is on the ballot for the first time in more than a decade. The Oscar race is on with a major surprise. Don't miss. Lady Gaga, predicted by many to sew up a nomination for House of Gucci, did not get one. I subscribe to unconventional punishment. And the rest of the cast was shut out too. Gaga told us this about working on her passion project. You know what, it's not about outdoing each other, it's about working together. Today, she said this. To all the nominees, congratulations, my friends. Bravo. Olivia Coleman, Jessica Chastain, and Nicole Kidman are up for Best Actress. I'm Lucille Ball, and I'm being funny, you'll know. You accepted the role, and then you thought, wait, what did I sign up for? Literally each day, let's just go in there, do the best we can each day. Kristen Stewart is also in the category, a first-time nominee for her transformation into Princess Diana in Spencer. Will they kill me, do you think? I think playing somebody that everyone loved so much was the most daunting thing. Penelope. Penelope Cruz is also nominated for Best Actress, her husband Javier Bardem for Best Actor. What would it be like to take the carpet with Penelope oh as not? That, that would be something, that would be something amazing. Right? I mean, that, was, that would be something pretty special for sure. It's a beautiful thing and kind of emotional too because, you know, things are going well for both and we have projects that we love and we don't take that for granted at all. Will Smith and King Richard. Will got his first nomination since The Pursuit of Happiness in 2007. He played Serena and Venus Williams' father in King Richard. The king has arrived. Hey, Will, should I, should I call you your highness? Yeah, well, you know what I mean. You can call me whatever you want to call me, as long as you call me. <laughs> his category is also an Academy Who's Who, including Andrew Garfield and Denzel Washington, who opened up about a possible nomination for his role in The Tragedy of Macbeth. It's not something you think about when you're, when you're playing the part, you just try to, you know, do the best job you can. Benedict Cumberbatch was also nominated today for playing a ruthless ranch owner in The Power of the Dog. Benedict's co-stars, and they're married, Kirsten Dunst and Jesse Plemons got their first nominations, both in the supporting categories. What are the joys of just being in a relationship and also being able to work and create together? She's my favorite actor to work with. There's an e easy element to it that just makes it makes it more fun. We're good at like jumping off the cliff together, you know what I mean? Yeah. Cody Smith McPhee is also up for supporting actor. The film received the most nominations with 12. Dune was close behind with 10. Belfast and West Side Story each received seven, including Ariana DeBose for Best Supporting Actress. The fact that I got this far, I'm like, this is really lovely and amazing and I will keep all of this with me for probably the end of time. And this singer is up for her first Oscar nomination. Beyonce is recognized for her song from King Richard. Her husband Jay-Z was not nominated. The best song category does include Billie Eilish and her brother Phineas. And we will be at the Oscars when they air March 27th on ABC. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.